No bans on pit bulls allowed. That's the message coming from the state Senate in Lansing today. The new legislation is aimed at stopping local governments from banning certain dog breeds perceived to be more aggressive. Larry Spruill joins us live in Dearborn Heights. And Larry, where does this bill go from here? Well, Jason, the Senate made a huge move tonight, but the House still has to take a vote on this issue. And I talked to both people on both sides of this topic of this conversation tonight. I don't care for uh, Rottweilers or um, pit bulls. And Lawrence West tells me he has a good reason for it. Just two weeks ago, he had a too close for comfort interaction with a stray pit bull in his neighborhood. The dog forced his way into uh, my home, uh, my backyard, and then attacked my dog. That's why West is a little perplexed with the news of a new bill aimed at stopping local governments from banning dog breeds perceived to be more aggressive. Thursday, state senators voted 22 to 13, basically saying no bans on pit bulls. Right now, about 30 of Michigan's local governments have some form of legislation already in place, and West agrees there should be. But I think a ban could have curved that uh, incident. What we are looking to do from the Michigan Humane Studies perspective is to have a law that is fair to all dogs, regardless of breed and fair to all owners. Anna Crispin with the Michigan Humane Society agrees with the Senate vote. She tells me she says a ban is not the answer. And we don't believe that any particular one breed is inherently vicious or dangerous. It's that individual animal. And again, the Michigan Humane Society says that pit bulls are not naturally aggressive animals, that the owners or the way they are brought up normally makes them that way. Again, the House will have to vote on this soon. We're live in Dearborn Heights tonight. Larry Sproul, Local 4.